Hi everyone, I'm JD from Willow Bound Journals and I have two new journals to share with you. These are Alice in Wonderland themed journals, also through the Looking Glass themed journals. And I'm using beautiful papers for the front and back covers here. And that came from In Love Art Shop. And this one I'm calling Looking Glass with all the different frames of mirrors here. And then this one I'm calling Queen Alice because of the crown and she's also wearing a crown on the back. So love, love, love these papers. Love how they turned out as covers. And these are both available in my Etsy now. And along with, there's one left of the previous Alice collection, this one here, if anyone was also interested in that type of style. But what I love about these papers especially is, along with the vintage look and the collage, <laughs> is there's a bit more blue. These were quite a lot of, you know, red and yellow toned. This more blue toned, which I am really enjoying, as you can tell by my nails as well and matching. <laughs> so let's do a flip through. First thing to note, on the front of the journals, we have the opening title page to Alice in Wonderland or Alice's Adventures in Wonderland and this one through the looking glass so I like that and then here I love the opening page here with the um, wallpaper pocket with flowers so my idea my favorite scene in the movie of Alice in Wonderland the Disney cartoon version is the garden of talking flowers and so there are a lot of flowers in this journal and I also love that creativity and imagination of when Alice has to first drink this bottle to be able to get through the door to Wonderland. And then from then on, you know, she has to eat and drink different things. And that uh, determines what she can do in Wonderland, which is really, really creative and clever. And so there's these bottle stickers that I also got from In Love Art Shop that are on these handmade tags and all of the tags are made with Alice in Wonderland book pages. So that's really cool. Um, and I just love how everything goes together really, really well in this particular journal. They're all on theme. Maybe I can flip them together at the same time. Let's do that. I use some more of those papers from In Love Art Shop in the journal itself. And I'll link their website down below if you're interested in checking them out as well as links to the products I got and a discount code you can use. And that discount you can use store-wide, not just on the products I got. And then pages from the Alice in Wonderland book that I have are used throughout this book and I just, a journal, journals, and I just use some of my favorite pages that are representative of the book and what I love about the book. Um, vintage ledgers, lots of writing space as well though. Love this representing the bottle again. And here, another jar, sticker, the flowers come from, I believe, either Stationery Pal or Your Creative Studio. Again, some of my favourite pages from the book with the illustrations or just something interesting about it in how it's formatted or laid out. Lots of handmade tags here. I showed a video of these tags, sort of a work in progress, making those. Love, love, love. Another one here, just so wonderful. <laughs> I really, really enjoyed making these journals and how everything just kind of came together and flowed. Oh, I've gone a bit fast on this side. Some vellum and some doily with some texture. Some of my handmade envelopes there with flowers, more envelopes here. Napkins and more tags here with the bottles and the flowers. And more flowers there. There's a book page from the book. More tags and flowers. More vintage paper. And some floral paper here along with some more tags. Going to the other side. <laughs> and another bottle sticker or jar. I love how they're all different shapes as well, different sizes and craft paper it's for lots of variety. Love that one with the blue flower. Gorgeous. And the back. 
over here. So those are the two Alice journals. Hope you enjoyed that magical, whimsical flip through through Wonderland. <laughs> Hope these can be a special treasure for whoever may receive these journals. Uh, like I said, they're in my Etsy, so feel free to check out the link to my Etsy shop with my bound journals down in the description box. There's also a 50% off sale across all my digitals. And I uh, hope you enjoyed that and I will see you in the next video. A big Bye thank you to my beautiful patrons who supported me in July. I literally cannot do this without you, so it means the absolute world to me. If you would like to support me for the month of August, feel free to head on over to my Patreon. The link is down below in the description box. And that is where you get access to extra videos, the Make a Journal With Me series, and the sneak peeks to my journals and creations and first access for all of those plus printables, every digital kit in my Etsy, and mail tiers, and lots of fun goodies over there. You are also welcome to donate through PayPal or buy me a coffee as a once-off thing anytime. Thank you so much for all of your support and for being here with me on this creative journey.